Oh, this is never good. Well. It's never good when you got a manure spreader in the shop and she still has manure in it. I wish I could say we got rained out, but it's not what happened. Spread manure last night, about 10.30 or so last night uh, from across the road. I uh, cleaned up before we get cows started to move over and everything. And the webbing broke. And I know some people are going to say, well, what's the webbing? Well, the webbing is what makes the manure go to the back of the... Comes to the back of the manure spreader. Now... This is the web. So that's basically just one big long chain with crossbars on it that makes the poop go to the back. Uh, I noticed it, didn't hear anything, but I noticed, as you can see, that side is that way. This side is not. So, we are gonna fix this, <laughs> hopefully. I have a bunch of spare webbing here, so that's a bonus, I don't have to go buy it because I looked it up just for my own curiosity and each individual link now is like seven bucks. So definitely not cheap by any stretch. Not that anything's cheap anymore. But uh, so we're gonna hopefully get this all fixed up uh, and get the rest of it spread out of it. So my goal is, and you see I got to come along on it I'm hopefully just gonna pull, I'm pulling on the junk link I need to pull out. Um, I need to move it back, I don't know, probably three, four inches at least. I don't know, yeah, probably about four inches. You can see how this is where it is on this side and then the other side, the bar is about ready to go over the back. We need to get that all into the same area. So then that way um, we can get some more webbing and get it in there. So, oh well. See, we're making any progress. Oh yeah, we're making good progress here. Real good progress. See how kind of progress we're making on the front. Ultimately, it's gotta get dragged from up, up from here, up. So, you see it's pretty loose still there. So, you gotta get that drag up in there. <sighs> Keep on going, I guess. Keep on going. So this is webbing, uh, this is what it actually looks like. So each individual link can be taken apart by pounding them out, not this way, you gotta flip them over this way and then you pound them out. Um, basically made so that way they don't ever come apart. So we're gonna take seven links out of here. We're gonna take, yeah, seven total links. Um, so one, two, three, four, seven. Okay, there's number seven. So we're gonna pull it apart here. Um, we're going to pound it out, but uh, we'll get this taken care of. Today it pays to have an old manure spreader sitting around. Right there, there's seven links. Times that by seven bucks, that's what I would have paid at Tractor Supply. Works to have an old piece of webbing laying around um, just in times of needing them. Uh, so we're gonna get this put on. Uh, might be a little bit of a bear to get it on there, but 
what we're going to do is we're going to try getting her on nice and easy they make little hand tools for these to put these webbings together i do not have one so we used a block of wood and a hammer got her done so what i'm going to do here is i need three links i'm going to drive them out uh hopefully it dries fairly easy we'll see have an easy. I don't think they go on that easy. There we go. There's the three links I need. Um, you see, like I said, yeah, basically they all drive apart, but when they're running in a, in a line, they'll never come apart unless they break, evidently. Um, so those four, you never know when you're going to need them. All right, got it together on the top. We got it together up there on the top there, as you can see. Um, so, take it down out of there. Never uh, and you see, it's still been nice to get that extra, like two inches there. That, that would really help down on the bottom, but um, we'll get this. It's all together down there now. Uh, now we just gotta get the bottom all hooked up down here, which you can see that chain link hanging down now. So hopefully this will go together fairly easy. Hey, we're back. It's the next day. An air spreader is fixed. Um, got that done. You guys kind of seen some of it there in the beginning. I quit filming because it was just getting harder and harder. Um, the webbing didn't want to come out. How to get another come along uh, and use it to get the, to pull it through. But we got the rest of that load spread off. So now it is time to get the rest of this manure over here on this side of the road cleaned up. Uh, this side of the road is where all the cows are going to be coming here. Uh, in the very near future as you can see it all greening up really nice behind us so there's two pastures here there's this one here and then on the other side of the trees over there as you can see the little pathway through there um we go through there and it goes the full length down through uh this is where we were feeding hay last year up here uh so need to clean up all the manure and hay off of that and then this is their run-in i'm um, getting out of the weather uh, a couple things we need to do with this run in is we need to put our sunshade on which is going to go right above me here in this section it doesn't have anything um it'll come down and it'll go onto the fence over there so that's one thing it needs done along with some a bunch of little small things got to turn the water on the water is spring fed that's piped in from up on the hill and then so once we get that done i got one strand of fence to fix be about done so Let's get the rest of this poop loaded up and get it spread out on this field here. Now let's hope this time doesn't go like last time. Because last time the spreader broke. So let's hope this time goes a little better. I'm gonna turn that down for you, huh? I don't want uh, YouTube to get YouTube mad at me. Uh, but yeah, so let's hope everything goes well with this load here. Because not, I guess I'll have to load them super light. Which, not the end of the world, but it takes a little longer. But uh, we got ourselves a pretty full load. Like I said, I ran the other load out and I ran one other load through, so I know she's running okay. Uh, let's hope she runs okay, you know, but I guess we'll see.
completely fixed. There's definitely something hanging up down there. I don't know exactly what it is. I don't know. Something just keeps hanging her up. I think it's that one. I just don't know. I just don't know. I think it's the one, but I can say that, and that could be completely wrong. There's definitely something holding her up, but I don't know exactly what it is, but we'll get her figured out. Now we're finishing it up tonight. Uh, I just got this last little bit here. Uh, I just got to get it on the manure spreader over there. So we got all the lights on. We're working to get this last little bit spread here. Uh, that way we can get up on up on the field here, which we got pretty much this whole thing spread um, down down the edge, clear down towards uh, DG. So we're doing pretty good, I'd say, you know, all in all. Uh, just gonna get this last clump of stuff here as I kick a little bit over here. Uh, this was all areas of hay last year towards the end there and then uh, this spot here was uh, a secondary spot that had hay so well let's get that last little bit loaded up here and we can finish up this time oh well we just gotta get it out that's all point there you see not too much there just back drag it a little bit Full. I know it's probably a little blurry, but things back there spread manure pretty darn good. That's a pretty big load. We don't usually load it that heavy. Uh, it's, it's the last load uh, for the probably for this year for the springtime spreading here. Uh, so getting it put on pretty thick on here. Uh, so Get it all nice and worked down in. This is probably going to be all turned into corn ground this year. Um, so, but and you see, it's back there just flipping her away. Doing a good job putting her on pretty heavy here. Uh, there is no manure sample on this. A lot of it was just uh, leftover hay and manure mixed. Uh, it smelled not so pleasant. Well, I won't deny it. Uh, so. We'll see how it they come on pretty good here. It's going on good. All right, well, the manure spreader is cleaning out here. Just want to thank everybody for watching this video. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. We hope we see you in the next one. Uh, we'll be moving cows over to this pasture that we are working out of here. So that'll be coming up here uh, right directly here. So, and uh, breeding's right around the corner for us. Uh, so there's going to be a lot coming up here real quick. Uh, so stick around the channel. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in the next one.